Hey everyone, Overlord 73 from GameAnyone.com. Uh, back on um, Dead Space Extraction on the PlayStation 3, which is a PlayStation Move game. We're on the story mode, Chapter 7 Life and Death. Beneath Hydrophonics, Dr. Karen Howell narrowly escaped death, but now she is forced to survive on her own. Got a ripper and the rivet gun. Can't select anything else, so that's what we're doing. This is Dr. Karen Howell, agricultural engineer. Even the water facilities aren't safe anymore. And the creature I saw down there was huge. And the poor souls I met there are surely dead by now. As is almost everyone else. I haven't found a single living survivor since I've left hydroponics. And what I've seen of the creatures indicates they have an ecology, a culture. They hunt in packs. They harvest their prey. They're not monsters, they're animals. Deadly animals. There is nothing to do but run. I'm going to take a tram to the shuttle bay. Maybe I'll find some other survivors there. But I doubt it. Ah! And now I'm seeing things. God help me. God help you indeed. Is anyone there? Help! Gun dealer. For God's sake, somebody help! Like no weapons throughout the game. Get off. Slicing, slicing dice. Hello? Can anybody hear me? Yeah, please take your time to read it, because I'm not. Suckers up. Ah, chop. Chops away. That's a messy, messy weapon. Get 
away from me. Shake the motion over there. Press your move button. Fuck off. Oh, where's my plane to when I want it? Rifle, yes, want that, thank you. I thought I'd be glad to see this piece of shit rifle. I see dead people. Yes, my name's Karen Howell. There's a medical room just around the corner. Can you walk? I think so. Be careful. The creatures are still out there. Sorry. Never mind. Let's fix you up. My head. I think I need to light on. It would be better if you stayed awake. Can you do that for me? Now, let's take a look at you. I'm going to work up an antibiotic that'll give your system a kickstart and clear your head. What's your name? How did you get here? 
I'm Lexine. I came here from the colony with some friends, but we got split up in the water tunnels. Dear God, I saw them. They're here? Where? Lexine, I'm sorry. They were attacked. I don't think they survived. What? No! You don't know, Ned. He wouldn't let them die. We have to go back to the tunnels and find them. All right, if that's what you want. But then we have to look for a way off the ship, okay? Okay. Let's go. Fire them all day, matey. You just put you on ice. Such dummy. Come 
that's where he took me there again. Catch. Get up now. It's dead. You Yay for it. me. My God. Come on. We must get out of here. Quickly, this way. Where are you going? The water tunnels are we'll this be way. We'll crawling with those things. I'm sorry, but your friends are dead. There's no way they could survive down there, and neither can we. We must get to the tram station. What were you and your friends doing on board the Ishimura? I thought there was a no-fly order. Don't you know? This is all happening in the colony too. Oh dear. side of the bloody room at me. Shave. Bit off the top, say. Oh, maybe a bit too much. Spinning around that quick. 
just jump through that wall. of my gun. hundreds of shitty fucking weapons Sake. Oh, that sounds like a plan. Run. Get in the elevator. Where are we going? Atmosphere control. It's the fastest route to the tram station from here. stuff up. Holy shit! Lexine! Weller! Eckhart! Nate! Lexine! Thank God! I told you they were still alive. We're alive. No thanks to you, Doctor. That's enough, Eckhart. You'd have run too if you had the chance. I'm happy we didn't lose you. Thanks to Dr. Hoyle. She saved my life. A cop, a grunt, and a suit. Quite the team. Don't get me started. What are you doing there? Trying to trap those creatures in the water tunnels. But I can't work out how to shut down the water flow systems. Then allow me. Hydroponics is my domain, remember? Great. Get on it. Is he in charge? He likes to think so. We were headed for the tram station, to get to the shuttle bay. Funny. So were we. McNeil with me. We can scout the route while the dock does her thing. I'm coming too. Sure. Eckhart, stay here and keep the dock safe. Of course. You take good care of her, okay? If it weren't for Dr. Hoyle, I wouldn't be here. I'm not a miracle worker, dear. Your injuries still need time to heal. Take care of yourself.
Lexine said you were an executive. She didn't say your name was Eckhart. Warren Eckhart, isn't it? That's right. Executive Director. Of Colonial Mining Operations. I know. You transferred to the Ishimura just a few weeks ago. <laughs> Worst bloody career move in my life. Nice to know my reputation precedes me. Sure it does. You're the one who switched all the personnel after they found the marker. One day, I had an assistant who'd been with me three years. The next, I found myself working with a grad student who spent her lunch hour praying to the marker. Staff rotation is standard policy, Doctor. Resource distribution is my responsibility. And what about seeding unitologists into every corner of the ship? Is that your responsibility too? I fail to see what difference someone's faith makes, Doctor. Look around, you stupid marker head. This awful mess is what difference it makes. If you don't get to see it... No, Doctor. My God has very different plans. You bastard. He's not a very nice man. Right, that's the end of that chapter. See you next time.